Ciao ragazzi, benvenuti al canale Spazio Gaming. In questo e nei prossimi video mostrerò il gameplay di Metaphor, Re Fantasio. Quindi se volete seguire la narrazione della storia, lo svolgersi delle missioni, dei legami, gli scontri con i boss e lo sviluppo degli archetipi, questo è il canale da seguire. He's here! Well, well. I truly didn't expect you to make it this high. The sanctuary was all but flooded with Magla. Zorba, was that your doing? You've heard of me then. Well, considering Lord Luis's influence, I suppose I shouldn't be surprised. Tell us, those bizarre Magla crystals, they shouldn't naturally form in a place like this. Are you responsible for them? Hmm? Oh, you mean the Melancholia Crystals? All I did was place a passable core or two along the path to make it easier for them to form. Melancholia Crystals? Yes, little more than a parlor trick to block your path using the newly formed crystals. All magic is derived from Motes of Magla. What you saw was just one possible crystallization of it. One that drives mortals to madness. <laughs> Speak sense. You claim this horrific aberration is something natural. That you had only the barest hand in its power? Melancholia, pure and simple. The result of pure magla at its most dense. Man or beast, any wretch who feels its power will go berserk. They'll see anyone as a threat. Some have their bodies hardened like scales. Some their very bones twist inside them until there's something else entirely. Melancholia, what are you trying to achieve? It's the scepter you're after, isn't it? You certainly ask a lot of questions. I'm afraid I haven't the time for answers. There is much yet to prepare. Hey! I'm not done talking to you. You've done nothing but talk. Perhaps you should have listened instead. Is this... a piece of bone? I had to find some use for the scattered pieces I couldn't animate into soldiers. And now I have three more fools to grind down for the pile. Look out! Take cover! Ugh. Don't fancy our chances making it through that. What do you think? Maybe if we hit the bones hard enough? We've no weapons that could hit them at such distance. How about we fall back for now? There's not much we can do here. I don't like it, but we've no other choice. Let's pull back. <laughs> it really has been one nuisance after another here. I suppose my crushing you will be the last lesson you learn. <laughs> Come to me if you can!
damned Zorba. He would go to such lengths to desecrate the royal's legacies. Damn frustrating to get stuck after coming this far. No other paths either. Are we just going to have to charge through? We cannot evade such a barrage, nor will our armor protect us fully. There has to be a better way. We could use a shield, or something close enough to it. A shield? Well, for lack of a shield proper, can you think of anything we might use? The painting of Luis. What? From the portrait hall? Ah, of course! A marvelous gambit! If we shield ourselves with Luis's portrait, Zorba may well refuse to fire upon us. But it's just a flimsy painting. A painting that he took the trouble to protect, transport, and mount. If he truly worships Luis, might he not hesitate to shoot it? Point taken. I suppose it's our best shot. What? You degenerates! That! Don't mind us. We've rubbish to dispose of. Rubbish? You heathens! I'll pulverize you! Try if you like. Be ashamed to destroy your Lord Luis's pretty face, though. Ah! Underhanded, treacherous little! That's rich coming from you! Silence! You witless incompetence! Ah, I can't tarry here any longer. I have important things to do. However, you defile Lord Luis with this, this blasphemy! You'll pay! I swear! I'll make you regret this! Oh, so it's desecration when it comes to his lord, but the sanctity of the dead means nothing. No kidding. We must be getting close. Bene, concludo qui il mio video. Se volete seguirmi, iscrivetemi al canale.